All right, so this is Nicholas MKN, and this is my first After Effects tutorial. I already made my Photoshop one and a Lightroom one, and this is the one for After Effects. This tutorial is for color grading a video, and this is just a basic color grade, so you can play with it and figure out for yourself what you want to do. And I'm also going to supply this footage right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop this file in here. I don't think it works on Macs yet unless they have a codec for it or you convert it. So you may have to use your own video. And what we're going to do is we're just going to bring it down into where the composition usually are. And we're going to create two new layers. And one layer is a adjustment layer. And the next one is an adjustment layer as well. And I just duplicated that by pressing Control D. And we're going to name the bottom one to grade. And the top one to sharpen. Now what we're going to do is we're going to add sharpen to the first one and change that to 5 and we're going to hide and lock that layer. Now what we're going to do is add levels to the grade one, tritone, and contrast. And that's brightness and contrast by the way. So that's what we really need for the effects that we're going to be using. Now what we're going to do is we're going to change up a few things to give the video a better look. So we're going to change the contrast to 19 and the brightness to 2 by the way. The midtones I'm going to change to 0, 3, 7, wait, is that right? I already had it set up first. Three, 0, 3, 7, 5, 7, 1. And the blend mode to 34%. The input in the uh, levels, we're going to change to 24, and the gamma, we're going to change that to 1.1. I think that's gamma, by the way. Made a mistake on that. And there you go. Now what we're going to do is we're going to create the, the, the halfway line right here where one side fades into the actual color, and the other side stays uh, like before and after, and then they're both blending together. So what we're going to do is we're going to click on T, then we'll click on the layer again, and we'll uh, show the rulers and bring out a guideline to halfway so we might have to zoom this out a little bit and drag it right in the middle so about right there and I'm gonna bring this down and bring this to about yeah hundred percent and what we're gonna do now is we're, we're going to we're going to create two masks so start from the top uh, I like that we'll start from the top right here and boom one side, second side, and we're done. Now, all we have to do now is duplicate this grade layer, delete mass 2 in the first grade layer, and in another mask, we're going to delete mask 1. Alright, so now what we're going to do now is change the opacity of the mask by pressing T. So what we're going to do is go to 5 seconds, Set a keyframe, bring it down to 0%, go to 7 seconds, change this to 100, no, 75%. Now go to 10 seconds and click on grade 2. In grade 2, then what we're going to do now is press T and bring this down to 0. Also set a keyframe and then start from here. So for this one, I wanted to fade in slower, so I'm bringing this to 13 seconds. So it's a one second difference in the fade between the first and the second one. And bring this up to 75%. I'm going to let it sit for about 5 seconds. So I'm going to go to 18 seconds now. And set a keyframe. And then add really uh, 3 more seconds to this one to bring it up to 21 seconds. And bring both of these down to 0%. And to end this at 25, make this a 25 second video, I'll press Control K and turn this to 25 seconds. Unlock and show the top, the sharpen layer, and press Alt, closing bracket, and ooh, go back. Drag the time to all the way to the end, and then press Alt, control bracket and alt uh, closing bracket and that's the end of the video so now what we have is right here it fades in for two seconds 
it plays for two seconds. So you have the before and after, so the viewer can see. Next, then it shows the right mask uh, turning, getting darker. So now you have the full after, and now both of them are the exact same opacity. So now this stays for about, I think we had it for five seconds. And then after that five seconds, they both fade out together. And then from right here to here, which is about four seconds, we have them both at the exact same color. Or at least I thought we did. So let me go back and check on these. Oh, no, I didn't bring this one all the way down. So just bring this down to 0%, and there you go. So you might just make sure you do that. And that's it. Oh, my bad. Yeah. Just make sure both of them in at zero right here. I don't think I finished it. But yeah, that's it. And that's the end of the video. And that's how you do the transition in the color grade. And all you have to do is render it out. And there you go.